welcome back to the Gujarati case John this is my new video about the Scandinavian defense today I will teach you how to play against e4 with Scandinavian defense I have so many variations in this opening and I will explain you one by one in my every video so please don't forget to watch my all videos there are series of Scandinavian defense so let's start the first section is the portuguese gambit what is the portuguese gambit okay take your book and pen and write all the notations first e4 white plays black reply by d5 one more name of the scandinavian defense known as center counter gambit Okay, e4 d5. Then most people, ninety percent people, I think, capture the pawn, takes pawn. There is uh, some other variations like a decline uh, by moving to e5 or second move knight to c3. I will explain in my other videos. So. Today we will learn about the pawn takes pawn and now there are two variations for black queen takes pawn or challenging the pawn knight f6 here the best move and modern variation is knight f6 after knight f6 when white plays pawn to d4 ok now the starting of the portuguese gambit by moving to bishop g4 the chapter 1 after bg4 f3 we will learn about the chapter 2 after bg4 f3 bishop f5 and bb5 check i will teach you in my next videos so Today we will learn about the bishop g4, f3, bishop f5, then c4. Now, white want to defend his pawn on d5, but there will be horrible attack by moving to e6. White takes this pawn, and now one more surprise move for black knight c6 ok here before knight c6 and before pawn takes pawn there is two side lines from here white play sometimes g4 and that's not a good move I think it's a very 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 bad move for white because of after knight sacrifice knight takes g4 f takes g4 queen h4 check ok here only two options for white king d2 or king e2 ok first see about king d2 after king d2 Black will regain his piece by bishop to e4 and force move here knight f3 after queen f2 check. If bishop interpose, you can take opponent's knight by bishop takes knight. And if queen interpose, you can also take by queen takes knight. So you will regain your piece and white will endanger. Okay. Let's see about main variation e4 d5 after e takes d5 knight f6 d4 bishop to g4 f3 bishop f5 now c4 e6 in main line white captures your pawn by d takes e6 and now you will reply by knight to c6 in main line 
after knight c6 there are two more variation for white first e capture f7 check and bishop e3 supporting to this pawn okay after bishop takes uh, after e takes f7 now king takes f7 and white has three choice from this position first d5 second bishop e3 and third knight e2 knight e2 is the best i think so write down all variations by like uh, a variations d5 then b variations you can write uh, bishop e3 and c variation knight e2 in this position we will see about the first variation d5 after d5 black should play here knight to b4 now knight b4 threatening to knight c to check and white forced to stop by moving knight to a3 and now bishop c5 one more aggressive attacking move after bc5 white want to cover his king by bishop to e2 and there is a best move r e8 now white has only choice king f1 otherwise the threatening the bishop takes knight then bishop d3 okay after king f1 knight h5 again surprising okay as you can see here white can give a pawn but there is no matter after queen h4 white cannot save his king okay here i have more moves you can sacrifice your rook takes bishop after rook takes bishop if queen will take your rook then you can simply pinning the queen and if knight takes rook then simple queen to h4 and here is checkmate how can save his king by queen e1 is a mistake and queen has to checkmate so this is a very 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 danger for white white want to win a piece or pawns but black want to only checkmate okay let's see about the second variation e4 d5 it takes d5 knight f6 d4 bishop to g4 f3 bishop f5 c4 e6 d takes e6 and knight c6 okay stop here now white takes your pawn and king takes pawn and now the variation number 2 bishop moving on e3 after bishop e3 no problem you can develop your bishop by check after bb4 check here white has a good choice king f2 all other are bad moves because knight c3 knight will be pinned and r8 will coming okay after king f2 now black will play rook to e8 a3 and now i will give one more surprise for you rook takes e3 okay let's see what about the king takes e3 after king takes e3 and simple bishop c5 and this is also favor for black okay let's see about the a takes bishop if white takes your bishop and winning move rook to d3 because the line closing tactics here after bishop takes rook you can simply win the game by queen check king e2 and rook e8 
and there is no reply for that okay let's see more powerful moves for white e4 d5 e takes d5 knight f6 d4 bishop to g4 f3 bishop f5 c4 e6 d into e6 and knight c6 e takes f7 king takes f7 and knight e2 in this position knight e2 i think is a best option for white now no worry for black knight b4 and now white attack your bishop to knight to g3 knight g3 you can simple move your bishop to c2 queen d2 only good way and now bishop c5 brilliant sacrifice by black after d takes c5 rook e8 check now king has only good option king f2 knight d3 check bishop takes d3 is only good option and now queen d4 check and black wins because there is no choice after king uh, f1 you can simple take the bishop and winning the game okay let's see about the b variation instead of e takes f7 check e4 d5 e takes d5 knight f6 d4 bishop g4 f3 bishop f5 then c4 e6 d takes e6 knight c6 and in here white don't want to capture your pawn and white will develop his bishop to e3 instead of taking your pawn bishop e3 in this position you can give a check bishop to b4 and also you can play here queen to e7 you have two choices from this position but queen e7 is my first choice queen e7 then knight c3 white will develop his pieces and in this position you can simply do the long castle after king f2 f takes e6 knight g e2 and now knight b4 return in the knight d3 white want to stop by queen to d2 and you can play here e5 and this is a good position for black by the command stockfish okay let's see about e takes f7 after queen e7 e4 d5 e d5 knight f6 d4 bishop to g4 f3 bishop f5 c4 e6 pawn takes pawn and knight c6 bishop e3 and black will play queen e7 and here e takes f7 now black should capture by king king takes f7 and king f2 supporting his bishop king f2 rook to e8 
threatening the bishop and there is a force move queen d2 after queen d2 here surprise move queen d7 and white will stop your bishop c5 and open his bishop for giving a check so after c5 here you can cap sacrifice your rook to e3 after queen takes e3 knight takes d4 b c4 check bishop to e6 after bishop e6 knight takes e6 and next trade is bishop to c5 white force move to b4 and now you can play knight d5 this is more aggressive for black what will do after king takes e3 okay e4 d5 he takes d5 knight f6 d4 bishop g4 f3 bishop f5 c4 e6 d takes e6 knight c6 bishop e3 queen e7 pawn takes then king takes and king f2 and rook e8 after queen d2 queen d7 and c5 rook takes e3 if white takes your rook by king there is no problem here you can simply move your pawn to g6 now your next threat is bishop f6 check and skewer the king and queen so white will give a check there is no problem now you can play your king to e8 instead of bishop interpose and after king f2 again knight takes d4 knight a3 there is a force move because of the knight will come to c2 and white will lose his rook so knight e3 and bishop takes c5 and discover uh, discover check is created by black and next trade if white will move his king to f1 you can simply play your rook f8 and attack on the king side is very 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 danger for white so i hope you will like this video so don't forget my all videos one by one i will give you a series of the scandinavian defense so this is my first chapter the scandinavian defense uh, portuguese gambit we will see so many uh, variations about the portuguese gambit don't miss any videos thank you guys please subscribe and like my channel and if possible share my channel goodbye we will meet early as possible goodbye